Well, for Oklahoma's film industry to continue to expand, it will need a skilled workforce, and that's what's behind the Red Carpet Film Festival in Norman. Here's our Courtney Dehoff. With the red carpet rolled out and the cameras flashing, One, two, three. it looks like the Emmys have landed in Oklahoma. One, two, three, and one more. While it may not be the Emmys, the Red Carpet one, two, Film one, Festival two, is star-studded in its own right. Our goal is to bring Hollywood to Oklahoma. And they are doing just that at Moore Norman Technology Center. This guy's dream down here. Chris Kaliski is the digital video instructor. It's about bringing that real world experience right to our students so they know that here in Oklahoma, you can make a film and you can uh, go on and do bigger and better things. It's really an inspiration and that's the whole purpose for our festival is to give them that real world experience to show their films to the community and, and really get some expert advice as well from someone who is in industry right now living the experience. Because I'll know someone for a long time. Students produced short films, casting, shooting, and editing throughout the semester in preparation for the festival. It's everything from the pre-production all the way to post-production. So you have um, everything from getting the story, uh, storyboard, the scripting, uh, through the actual camera process, the setup, and then of course the post-production. More Norman even partners with the Academy of Television Arts and Sciences Foundation to bring producers onto the scene from some of our favorite shows to help the students understand how to interact with their actors and actresses. So uh, take a couple beats with Alex. Okay. Like you don't, I mean, we all know it's Alex. He's gonna, Ed Ornelas so, produces hits like Grey's Anatomy it, and wait, Private Practice. Say, let it register okay. and then so we get a chance to react. I hope that bringing real world experience into the classroom is useful for, for the students because I mean, I remember when I was a student and you're in a classroom and a lot of it is theoretical and you have, I would say, um, you know, a great experience working with actors, but it's only, you know, in that s small group that you're working with. When you go out into the working world, the professional world, and you're working with incredible talent, you know, I'm learning things from those people, from people like, you know, Patrick Dempsey and Sandra Oh and Kate Walsh and, and I like to take those things and, and, and take that experience and the things that I've learned and share that with them because there's no way to, to get that, to learn those things unless you're out there. And out there they are, showcasing a semester long project at a film festival designed to cast the future right. of film right. in One, two, three. Well, this year was the sixth annual Red Carpet Film Festival, the culmination of student film and design work at Moore Norman Technology Center. And joining me now are some digital media students from the Francis Tuttle Technology Center's program at Deer Creek High School. Now, I understand you guys actually do your own live shows. Yeah, we do. We film our sports, and we've done everything from football to basketball, and now we're moving on to soccer and baseball and we've done over 40 events and you can watch what we do on deercreekantlers.tv. So you're streaming all these things live. Mm -hmm. That's fantastic. Now this is above and beyond your just regular classes? Yes it is. It's an after school program. Uh, we have about 20 members in the team and it's, it's been very interesting to just get the opportunities to get those positions uh, in sports, broad, broad, sports broadcasting. We have producers, we have cameramen, we have directors. So students are really getting the hands-on experience from that aspect. Yeah, well that's absolutely fantastic. And I want to hear from you guys. What are your favorite things about doing this? Some of the favorite things that I've been enjoying is being able to get hands-on experience with this and actually, for a change, put a production on the internet for viewers to watch at home if they would like to. And on top of actually having real-world experience with that. And I do it for the leadership experience. We're live on the internet, uh, everyone's watching, so the to be a leader and lead your team through an experience like that where messing up is really not an option is really valuable to me, and that's why I do it. And apparently you're doing something right because you did win the statewide competition here in Oklahoma. Yes, we did. Uh, we won the Business Professionals of America Digital Broadcasting Competition. We'll be going to Indianapolis here in about a month. And uh, we're actually going to get a very interesting uh, opportunity. At, at Nationals, if we qualify for finals, we get to go out to the field and shoot a 60-second 60 uh, 60 package. 
and have it edited in about an, an hour and a half. So that's going to be a very interesting experience. Yeah, so true really real life skills. Well, 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 gentlemen, we really appreciate you coming in here to the studio. And and good luck and, and keep us posted on how you, you do. And you can see more of their work on our website at okhorizon.com.